Hi, today I want to show you how to archive a team. Not You can delete a team pretty easily, but I want to show you how to archive it so you, um, the team is still available, but it will disappear from your list here. So if you have a lot of teams, and let's say you had one from last year, you just don't want it to be in this list anymore. Uh, there's a couple of options. First of all, in the options here, you can say remove favorite. If I do that, then it no longer appears in this main list, but it drops down into this section here at the bottom called more. Alright, so here's all these lists. So I'm a member of all of the tutor group classes, so I just unfavorited them so they just kind of go down to the bottom here. So that's the first thing that you could do. Uh, you could, of course, delete the team. That will just delete everything and obliterate the team. Um, the other option is to archive the team. So if I go to this little cog icon here, Manage Teams, I'll get a list of all of the teams uh, that I'm the owner of. So uh, if I want to archive the team, I just go down to that test team one that I was looking at there, click the three dots over there on the side, and I can archive the team. All right, so that's another option. Uh, you can always unarchive a team. When you archive the team, it basically freezes it, and there's no activity. The students can't do anything, and I can make it read only. So the students could still access the team. They could see the stuff in there, but they can no longer change anything all right so that's a another way that you can get rid of the list of teams down the left hand side you could either unfavorite it you can delete it or you can archive it